Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel, The Spiritual Justice Gym. I'm sorry about the light, but if I turn it off, you can't see, see how that glare is there. I'm sorry you guys, I'll set up my camera better tomorrow, the next time I record, but for now, this is what we got you guys, so get into it. <laughs> um, yo, 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 yo. Okay, so we have, I'm reading for a woman here, well, it's a couple of women. Some women. And this is about money. Somebody, I don't feel like you're in a bind about money. I feel like you have a decision to make either. Do I focus on my money? Because it might be a little funny if I don't. Like if you don't, sorry. Focus on that. On your money. But I feel really feel like you want love. But you like, you sitting there like, who I'm going to give my heart to? Like... I feel like you really need to tap into your intuition here with this card here because you got the attachment card at the top. You really need to tap into your intuition. I'm sorry for see that. You really need to tap into your intuition because you don't know what to do. You lacking confidence in what to do. You lacking creativity. You have no idea what to do. What you want to do with yourself. Um, I feel like there is a guy on your mind. There is someone there. But, like I said, you don't know what to do. You don't know what task to take. You don't know whether you want to be about your money or you want to be about love. See? You don't know, you don't know which one you want to do. You want to be about, you can, I'm hearing you can do both. But if you, I'm hearing there's some kind of self-deceit here. The reason why you don't know what to do is because you're not tapping into your intuition. You need to tap into spirit because your time in this come, but you just have to have patience, spirit said. You just have to be patient. Your time in this coming. What else do I see in these cards? Yeah, see how she's just looking off like, hmm, all nonchalant. Like, I don't know what I want to do. But you you have a bunch of spirit guys around you who is trying to lead you into what to do. They're trying to lead you there. That's why you have this temple path card here. Because spirit saying if you follow your intuition, you can have both. You can have the money and the love. I'm just saying. Why you just have to have one or the other? You don't. You you. I feel like you're more focused on one thing at a time. But you can do both. As long, long as you have to multitask. And you can. Because you're a woman. You can multitask. Trust me. Boom. Boom. You're going to have the victory. You're going to have the money. You're going to have the love. You're going to have... You're going to have... You're gonna have <laughs> your needs going to be met in love. Emotionally. Everything going to be met. You're going to be abundant and you're going to be victorious. Just tap into your intuition. Just tap in. That's what I'm hearing. And have strength. Have strength that you're going to find love. And you're going to have money at the same time. Have strength and faith. That's what Spirit is saying. Have strength and faith. You're going to get this love. You're going to get victory. You're going to have the strength and you're going to have the money. Just tap in the Spirit. Just tap in. That's what I'm, I'm hearing. You don't have to be detached. You're looking at it from a one-way perspective. You see how she's only looking at it from one one side? There's no color in here. She's only seeing it one way. Like, open your mind. And the only way you open your mind is tap into your intuition, girl. You're a woman. Tap in. Tap, tap. It's right here. That your spirit guys are trying to tell you you can have both if you just tap in. You can have both. <laughs> you had the money and the man. If You don't, you don't got to choose over one or the other. Usually, most of the time, when you have your... um. Stuff together, you'll snit together. You can um tap into both. Like you can have both. I'm here spirit say just tap in. I'm just gonna clean up the cards real quick and just pull you some more advice cards. I feel like it's like a little hiccup for you. Like you can just get into it. I feel like you're kinda young too. So you just like I can only have this at one time. I can't have both, but you can have both. I don't know how old you is. Okay, I'm hearing you you probably a little like 16, 18, maybe even 20, somewhere in between there. Yeah. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, because you don't have some heartbreak. That's what that is. You have you had heartbreak in the past. Yep. And it left you confused. Like, okay, if I get have love, then I can't have all this money. I can't have this abundance. 
but you can. And yep, if I have this abundance, then I can't have love. But you can have both. I don't know who made you feel that way or who you was dealing with. But you can have both. Yep. So we're saying you got the well in your hand right now. You can have both. You see how the, that wind is blowing? Give it the spirit. You can have both. Tap into your intuition. And then you will know which way to go. You'll see which way to go. Because it'll be easy. You'll just start doing stuff that makes sense. See? That love. That commitment. They got the money. They on the beach. Yeah. Yeah. They both. You you, you a young person. You're you going to find love. And you're going to have the money. It's going to go both. You're going to get both. You're going to get both. You just got to tap into your intuition. Yep. Yeah. See? Spirit confirming that you're a youngin. You may be like from 16 to 20. That's what I'm picking up. You young. You're really young. <laughs> and that's why you think you can't have both. You may went through some kind of trivia heartbreak. Yep. And it left you in your head about it. You just stop using your intuition because you you feel like it don't benefit you nothing. You don't you don't even actively know you're doing this, but that, that's what you're doing. Yep. Everything is going to balance out. You're young and everything. Your new beginning is coming. And you're going to balance out. You're going to balance out this. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yep. Yep. You're going to go get it. You, after you tap into your intuition and you understand and realize you can have both, you're just going to boom. It's just going to start happening. Mm -hmm. Spirit said you can manifest it. Look. You're going to be happy. I'm happy for you. You're going to be happy. You're going to have that abundance. Look at all those flowers. Look at her hanging with her homegirls. Just chilling like, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm glad I listened. Mm -hmm. You're going to be glad you tapped into back into your intuition. You're going to be glad you figured out what was wrong. You're going to be so happy. You're going to be like, oh, that's it. <laughs> that was all I had to do. I'm so happy for you. you you're going to get both. Yep. You just got to get out your head. You got to stop just being stuck in your head in one way of thinking, Spirit said. See, it's okay to be logical, but don't just be stuck in your head. You can be rational about something practical, practical, but just don't be stuck there. You know what I mean? Just don't be stuck there because your happiness is coming. It's coming. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm in a really good mood. I, I just got happy when I read for you. Whoever this is, I'm so happy for you. You Like I said, you're young. You're in between 16 and 20. And you just, because you're young, you think like it has to be one way and it doesn't. You can have both. I mean, you know you can have both, but you don't realize that you can have both. Because we can know something, but we don't come into a realization like, ah, that aha moment. Like, you don't be like, yeah, I can do both. Like, you just got to switch up a few ways. Like, that way you think and tap into your intuition. And, baby, we women. We super, we super powerful. So, you know, you can have both. Love and money. It don't have to be. I know this world like money, 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 money. And like they showing love now just just recently but i know back in the past it was just oh money 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 but you can have both you can balance out both you can have both if you want both um i really want to pull an angel number i don't my spirit guys let me see it's very kind of pulling my angel number they telling me no that you don't believe in angel numbers maybe you need to get into it <laughs> Get into it. Get into it. Okay, so I'm trying to. Okay. 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 Your homework, because I don't feel like you believe in angel numbers or don't know anything about it. Either way, it kind of came out flipped out. Something is manifesting in your life. That's 634 and that's 74. Sorry, that's 743 and that's 734 and the 743. I'm sorry. Um, it's your angel numbers, your two angel numbers. That's your homework to look them up and see what spirit is talking about. Tap into that intuition, baby. It's beautiful.